looking familiar in the sense of this is how much space was here and how empty it was when I first arrived two years ago. Still crazy. Um, so we've moved everything. I've left cleaning supplies. That's trash. Um, we have the wallpapers in the rooms. Gotta take this down. Gotta take that guy down. And then I'll film me taking those down because I was experimenting over here. So this one I already kind of knew. This is like really cheap. That like contact paper you're really supposed to just put like, I don't know, in a drawer. And as you guys can see, it really did not want to come off the wall. So I'll do my best, but I'm not gonna, like look, it's really like peeling off in like little pieces. Like I'm not gonna deal with that. They're already gonna get the deposit so they can deal with that. Um, versus the other wall, which you guys didn't get to see me do, um, came off really easily. Um, like there's a little strip here, I'll show you. This will come off, like look, already. Just one strip comes right off. Oh, we have another little strippy strip right here. I can show you this guy comes off real. Oh, except for I can't get the corner. It's the one thing you gotta get like a good little piece, but look, comes right off. So if you're gonna get the wallpaper, this one also, very smooth texture. Like this is meant for like just your drawer. And you, I could just tell anyone putting it up, it wasn't gonna do well. This one, on the other hand, has a little bit of a texture to it. You guys can see it there. Um, and it's a bit thicker um, and it's still very adhesive. Like I could reuse this again. So that's kind of nice to know. Um, hey guys, welcome to our week of for first week of chaos in the new studio. Um, as you can see, we are all nicely moved in to the studio, but everything is just kind of everywhere and random projects keep happening. Like uh, the last thing I need to be doing is the bathroom, but it's my obsessed uh, project that I've been working on. So we're in the middle of painting. That wall looks great. This one's looking like it's gonna need a second coat. So I gave it a fan, so we're letting it dry. And then if we go out this way, we'll see that I got distracted and decided that I didn't like um, this handle anymore. So we took the handle out the door and we've decided that we now need a new door handle for that. And we're gonna get one for the bathroom. Um, so there's that. And then, you know, if we just walk through the large studio space that we have now, um, which is cool and overwhelming. We come out the And I'm sorry if it's loud, we're on a busy street. But if we come over here, we can see that I'm working on a DIY project out here. We had a white shelf. I've spray painted it gold. We're letting it kind of sit in the sun. It's doing okay. Um, we'll check on it in a little bit, but doing a lot. And then coming back in, we're you know organizing my random door handle, glassware on the floor. Uh, I had to move the bathroom things out, planters. Uh, we have upstairs. There's projects happening up here, uh, which is what we're going to be focusing on right now. Is It's not the most fun thing. Um, it looks beautiful when it's done, but as you can see, I'm having a bit of trouble, and my friend was here helping me, but they had to go to work, so I'm going to see if I can finagle with it and try and get it up myself. Um, and there's that one, and I have a variety of different wallpapers. This is old wallpaper from the old studio, so that's scraps. Um, that's the bathroom wallpaper. We have another box downstairs that has another wallpaper, but yeah, that's where we're at today and you know, just hope you're having a good day and trying to kind of keep you guys up to date with what we're doing in terms of the new studio space and getting it set up and trying to do that within two weeks, which is a little bit of chaos as well as trying to one, get it done and then also film it and show you guys what I'm doing. All right, I'm going to get to work.
what's happening here? Do you want to remove these first? No. <laughs> not, not at all. Please just cover them up. <laughs> After yesterday, fuck now. <laughs> Absolutely. I looked at them and I was like, I'm covering you with wallpaper. <laughs> Fuck everybody's yeah, couch. Be fucked up. Yeah, I was like, I thought I thought they were painted onto the wall. Okay, I thought we were just gonna paint over these blue flower bitches. No, 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 no. And look, they rip off the fucking paint. Fuck that shit. So, my wallpaper should just go right over them flowers. Oh, I think I gotta go back upstairs. Why? We gotta grab that out. I have it. I brought it with you. You mean a little. He's very handy. I'm on hang. I get tension, so like you want to pull it a little bit when you're going down. One eternity later. All right, guys. A little update on the bathroom. Uh, so we painted this wall and the one behind me, raspberry creme. Um, we're working on the wallpaper here. I sadly put this one upside down, and this wallpaper is so like on there that it won't come off so we're just gonna leave it um that one i got up uh we've been working on how to cover up the blue flowers and i realized i didn't fully document all of this but um we tried to spray it with some wd-40 uh that sort of worked but not really uh, i was able to get all of the long stems off and then if you look closely you'll see that i've painted over some of them just to make them not as visible and then if we go over here you can kind of see like there's a like you can see this was like a stem for a flower you can kind of see it all the way through uh here um but you can't see the little flower petals so like here's a good example right here the flowers you can't really see them through um so we're gonna finish wallpapering today is my goal um, we're just letting this dry, and then I thought about that I should give you guys a little update on where we're at with the bathroom, and then I've still got to figure out what I'm doing with this chaotic floor. It really doesn't match my overall really pink, girly aesthetic in here, so we're uh, figuring that out. I did buy some fake tiles, but it looks like I need to get more if that's what I'm going to do, and then I'm wondering if I'm going to do that. Um, getting white paint on the ground makes me feel like maybe I should just maybe paint it white. I don't know. So that one is still up for debate on the floor. Uh, but yep, yeah, that's the little update here in the bathroom. And I'm going to get back to wallpapering, guys. <laughs> So it's a white uh, floral wallpaper and it's just the sticker wallpaper and it's got the pink peonies and then I put a chair there just so I could kind of get a little bit of a visual. Uh, we're going to be putting a curtain rod and curtains are going to be happening here and I think my battery is about to die so let me change that and I will be right back. And as I was saying this is our pink peony wall. It's beautiful. Um, on the opposite wall over here, I'm going to be doing another floral. It's on the floor there. I'll show you guys in a second. Um, but we're going to be filling this wall with this floral pattern here. Focus in. Kind of tried to do it opposite. So we have a dark floral, back, uh, black with a floral, and then we have a really nice light color over here with the floral. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be filling this whole wall and that's what I will be doing today and I will do my best to share some of the process and behind the scenes with you guys, but this battery, even though it should have been charged, is dead too. <laughs> Take 
get away, take it away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. 